good day friends it is me hl mod tech and i am back with another tinkercad design friends this is a useful 3d print so let's get cracking so my friends this is tacky glue if you've ever taught a stem class it is super handy dandy the only problem is i am always losing these caps if you're looking behind me those are my tinkercad designs to replace the cap yesterday though i came up with an idea are you ready for this this cap slides on like this and then it will stand up so the glue is all ready when you flip it back you can pull it off there is a little piece of wire in there that fits inside the hole so that it keeps your glue unplugged. How cool is that? So I've got all these designs here because I wanted you to see that there's a lot of trial and error. I did measure, but then I adjusted. This is what that cap looks like. It is just the cone, and then there is a hole inside that the wire can be pushed through. If you search gauges on Google, it looks like it's between 14 gauge and 15 gauge. I know that it was two pairs of household wire. I split that and then I just cut off a piece about an inch long, stripped it, and then I used a hammer to tap it into place. Real quickly, let me show you the design in transparent mode so you can see in it. You can see that I've got these supports here to make the cone a little bit stronger. I did sink these in just a little bit, that's why they're cut flat. And then I put a V1 on it just because. If you were looking for the parts, friends, I do want to share this with you because it's one of my favorites. This is just two cones where I cut them out. What's nice about these cones is you can instantly type the radius of what you're building and change them to an inverted cone just like this. So if I go from five to two, boom, it instantly changes. So the cone is one of my favorite designs to work with. Friends, this is my favorite type of project for Tinkercad. I knew I wanted something. I didn't know exactly what it was and I just started slapping things together, trying to get the coolest design ever. And then all of a sudden, one day, I had the inspiration to make this little guy, which I think is pretty fantastic. Hopefully, friends, you find it useful as well. Don't forget, you can check the description. There will be a link to Thingiverse. Lastly, friends, if you enjoyed the video, please give it a like. If you got a question, comment, or a suggestion, add it down below. If you haven't subscribed yet, what are you waiting for? Smash that subscribe button, and last but not least, hit that notification bell if you want to be the first to know when there's a brand new video from me, HL Mod Tech. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.